I got him. It feels like a pretty good one. Yes? Rig fish? I can't believe I have fish Finally. Oh, God. There we go. God, they're pretty in the water, aren't they? Well, welcome back, gang, to another episode, and it's the lovely Lake of the Ozarks. And, of course, it's freezing-ass cold. It's Ronnie Kane and myself, and it's, uh, it's a true impact outdoors event on Lake of the Ozarks, so we're allowed to throw the Alabama rig. I know, that's kind of a weird subject for some of you guys. It is for me too. I'm not going to tell you I love it. It does get bites. And when it's allowed, I'm afraid you need to throw it if it's cold water. At least that's how it is here in Missouri. Maybe it's not that way where you are. But I know right in the middle of the country, when the water's in the 40s, low 40s, particularly low 40s, and it's allowed, you should throw it. So <clears throat> here's one of the rigs that I choose. It's not a... It's nothing super fancy. It is a very, fairly large rig. The, the blades are, you know, they're like number four, number five size. They're counter-rotating. I've got a full-size Zoom swimming fluke on there. I know that's a discontinued bait, but I got lots of bags of them, so I'm going to use them while I have them, and they do get bites. So uh, I have the, each one of those heads is a uh, Three sixteenths, even our dummies. Here in Missouri, we're not allowed to throw all hooks on all five of the baits. So we put a hook on the center one and the two bottom ones. Center one and two bottom ones. And then these two are dummies where they don't have any hook on them. I have them glued onto the shank there. That keeps them on there. And uh, <clears throat> that's our rules in Missouri, so. I know Oklahoma and maybe even Texas, you can have all five hooks, but rules are rules. So, like I said, it's Ronnie Kane and myself, and we're at Lake of the Ozarks, and it's clear, cold. I don't know what we're doing, but we're having fun anyway. Hopefully, you enjoy it. Ride along with us. If you like this kind of thing, smash the like button. Consider subscribing. Let's get to the video. There he is. Good morning. Good morning. How are you doing? Howdy, howdy. What snowed on it? And then Did it snow it. down here, Cole? Barely. Really? And it, they and, said the Lebanon got it like really good. Right, like seven inches. Yeah. And it didn't snow here at all. And we got probably four at home, and it finally, my driveway finally melted off yesterday. And I didn't shovel it. What's up, buddy? Do you know? Same old drill. Right. Those those uh, baits look familiar. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Everybody's got. Only need two rods, right? Right. Well, four, but only need two baits. <laughs> right. Two styles of baits. Yeah. Maybe only one color. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Just kind of depends. I'd be pissed. Yeah, color. Uh, no, that's not the spawn. It's a stuff. spring. Uh, spring reaction. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty cool looking bait. Uh -huh. Looks like a smallmouth killer. Look at how much blue shows up. Yeah. Table rock. Yep. Isn't that pretty cool? Like mm. That's an addiction. Be careful with this. I mean, that's a slap the vein addiction. There there. Well, good luck, guys. Yeah, you too. You know how it is. It's, it is about a little bit about luck. When I see how close to the baits we really all throw, yeah. it becomes a matter of... Luck goes a real long way. It does in this <laughs> deal. <laughs> Who's where what time. Right.
Him, we'll go over there. Yeah. I think we just uh, try the shade a little bit here. Try a little sick bay, a little A rig. Oh, yeah. Be a little cold in the shade today. I'm getting a little jerky. Uh, a little jerky is always a must. A little jerky attack. This is kind of a bluffy bank right here. This is a really good wintering hole. It's not way out here, it's like right up in front of it. Stay out, maybe get up here another time. Oh, it's 17 right here. I can tell by the guy's chairs he's a fisherman. Looks like it. Pretty good one. There's a bunch over there. Oh, it's not. Look, he's a keeper, though, isn't it? Damn, did I lose a bait? No, that was already in there. That's the sea. I got the same bite a second ago. There were just a whole lot of them right here. I'm going to back this out just a hair. And then I'm gonna spot lock it. You just keep throwing there. Cause they they're there. That was the the other one was a bite too. Cool. Cool, that's probably just barely a 15 inch. Good call Ronnie! Well I mean you gotta start somewhere. You just turn the boat that way towards it. Hell this fish is long, 16 and a quarter. So it's a baby A-rig fish. We have to keep that in perspective. <laughs> uh, yes. Affirmative. And that is the first.
But the games begin. Isn't that funny how we just get to the right spot? Okay. Um, I'm telling you, I got bit twice the same way. Secondary over there, you're talking about? Yeah, it rolls off. He's just hit, hooked in the head. He's doing circles. He might be a 15. I'll check him. Got it? Yep, I got it. But it's a stick bait bite. That was on Pro Blue. Swatted at it pretty good, must have. Sixteenth of an inch shy. Sixteenth of an inch or so. Not much, but just just shy. But where there's one, where was he in relationship to the dock? Where did the bite come from? the boat or he followed
lay up there for some reason I, I don't know it good enough but I've seen I know that uh, we've caught them back there I just don't know which which one's best try this a little bit and what would you think of new fish back there Rig or stick bait? I don't know if we'll get all mossed out or not. Seems awful mossy. Twenty-two. Twenty-two. Yeah, it's really deep. This is all really deep all the way back in here on the right. Shallower on the left. Almost here. Oh yeah, it is. Oh yeah, it is. It's a keeper. Isn't that a keeper? Yeah. Yeah. God, they're pretty in the water, aren't they? They got all that color. Take him and put a tag on him for us. Measure him. I think he's there. Good. Measure him. So. Okay. Yep, 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 sticking that out there. I barely got it. Thank you. Yeah, I don't even know he's a keeper. I knew he wasn't down there very good. I kind of feathered him in to bite and like he's... I know that other one up there was a bite too. Just barely 15, he's gotta be the first one to go. First one to go and we'll remember he's... He's number five. Got one? Okay. Yeah, you're right. I'm sorry. All right. Good history.
there's one. Bacon. I can't tell. That's still a little hard, but no, maybe not. Well, it's a, it's, oh, it's getting bigger. Getting better? It's getting bigger. No. No, you got it. Sweet. Hit it hard. Hit it as good as anybody's hit it today. on time, buddy. Yes. <laughs> You ain't gonna need a whole lot of water. Let me see that. Yeah, there we go. Hold that. Let's see this number five guy. Cause he's the one. I think he makes it pretty good.
Man. Babies. Yeah, that's all I got. Uh, I got one good one and a bunch of babies. You ain't got even a good one. I mean, like, we got 10 pounds. One pound. That's, that's 13, ain't it? 1260. Oh, 13. Oh, really, really small. Monsters. <laughs> I'm big. I'm telling you, we threw the A rig. We thought we were really gonna get them. I got a bunch of literally a lot of 12, 13 inch fish today on a big giant rig. He got five. Yeah. Love <laughs> Like 11 something. <laughs> it wasn't even 12 pounds. You got us. You got us. That wraps up the second true impact of the season. And well, caught quite a few fish, just not the right fish. Just literally just two bites away from winning the thing. That's how these deals are. It's just about getting the right bites. So it is what it is. Hopefully you like this kind of thing. Smash the like button. Consider subscribing. Till next time, thanks for watching. Oh, That's a big old giant bass.